Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises unto Yahweh, by Shami Awashai, by Shem Rakal Kodash, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and peace, blessing, and mercy to you, brethren, on the four corners of the earth, pushing this word in sincerity and truth. The Habayah Dawada, the house of David, the elect. Peace and love to you, few sisters, listening, humility. All right, um, so we, we must never forget that 2018 is the year of prophecy, okay? We're, uh, what, tomorrow is June 1st, and so we're halfway through the year, and, you know, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh has already rendered uh, many judgments upon this place, you know, but there's another half a year to go. You know, it says, uh, you know, and this year has flown by, man, you know, roughly paras paraphrasing, it's saying those days are uh, are hastened for the elect's sake, you know, the, the times are being sped up for the elect's sake, man. You know, and Yahweh Bashem Yahweh is bringing the, 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 those prophetic times upon this place in these latter days. Okay? The word prophesy simply means to say before. Okay? And that's what the men of Great Millstone from the apostles on down and those of like mind and like doctrine uh, are, are saying. You know, we're saying before, we're, we're telling the world about America's destruction, that thermonuclear missiles are coming to this place. We're... Uh, Many things are happening in 2018, you know. Uh, Yahweh Hashem Yahweh can bring uh, any prophecy that he want to come to play with the snap of a finger, man. You know, and so Lord willing, we, we get more of those prophecies come uh, before this year is wrapped up. You know, you got the mark of the beast, which is already being implemented. You got uh, Sweden uh, chipping their employees. They, they said they had 90 uh, percent of their company came to get chipped you know you got people having chipping parties you know that rfid chip is going is the mark of the beast and and that's what's going to be uh pushed on the forefront of this society you know they're having uh they're planning to get the draft started back up you know uh the the lord might gather these armies down in yahweh shapat man uh, you know after this draft and these people are uh willfully signing up for the uh government for the armies and the armed forces well, honestly, that's the worst decision they can make in a time like right now, you know, but Jake, one of the so-called blacks, Native Americans and Hispanics who are the children of Israel, they want to do something to make a quick dime, something to get away from society, you know, but also people aren't signing up for these armed forces. And so that's why they need to uh, do this draft because they know that World War Three is upon them. All right. It says uh, the third world cometh quickly. OK. And uh, did, so, you know, uh, Yahweh Shah is, is here, man, you know, uh, just that Isaiah 29 and 6, you know, that the, the Lord shall visit us with uh, tempests and storms and devouring fire. You know, these hurricanes are taking place. Wait to wait to you know that Maryland is being flooded right now. Uh, volcanoes are being, are being erupted all over uh, Hawaii. You know, uh, it's hurricane season. I'm in Florida. It's hurricane season, man. We're, we're about to start it. And so it's going to be worse than it was last year. You know, so all of those that are not sighing and crying for the abominations that are not doing the work of the Lord and do not have the name of the Heavenly Father and not believing on His Son, they're going to be uh, subject to the condemnation and the judgment of the Lord, man, His indignation, His righteous anger, okay? And you know, uh, it says um, in Revelations that Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy, okay? So that's why we're, why we're able to boldly go out and speak with authority about the things that are coming, man. Okay, Yahweh Shai uh, is within us, man, and uh, we're we're the example. He's the example in which we should follow after. Okay, and if he's the spirit of prophecy, and this is the year of prophecy, what do you think is going to come to pass? I mean, Yahweh Shai is uh is it, his spirit is amongst this earth right now, and, uh, and amongst Babylon, man. You know, he he's coming. It says in Matthew ten and thirty four, he came not to bring peace but a sword. So he's he's the spirit. Lord willing, you know he'll he'll make his Yahweh Shai will make their return this year, but you know if if not so, many prophecies are still going to come to pass with such a uh, with only a half a year left, and not until things begin to pop off that people are going to notice it, man. When the dollar collapses, you know when they can't buy and sell, you know their their victuals are so cheap right now that they should think themselves to be in good case. Okay, we were just talking about how. How these people cast away food and how they act like they don't have any options and things like that, man. When the Lord is about to bring this this famine and pestilence, that Jeremiah 28 and 8 says, um, I've sent my, I mean, the, the prophets before me and of old, 
have prophesied against many kingdoms, great countries of famine, evil, war, and pestilence. And those are the things we're prophesying about, man. First Corinthians 8 and 32 says the spirit of the prophets is subject to the prophets. All right. Ezekiel 33 and 33. Behold, uh, it shall come that they will know that a prophet have been among them. OK, so these things are going to come to pass in these latter days, man. So they're going to know who the true prophets of the heavenly father is. Lord willing, we're those men. All right. Been telling these people, uh, the two thirds of Israel and the heathen, that Yahweh Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai is about to make a return and lay judgment on uh, on them and uh, re 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 uh, restore and redeem that holy remnant, the one third of the nation of Israel. All right. And so we're constantly praying that we're among that number. OK, but if this is the year of prophecy. And Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy. You you think that you know that's like a a a, a, a call out to him, man. You know that that's a stamp that he he wants to come and uh, fulfill. Okay, he's like, hey man, I, you know I'm the spirit of prophecy. So if he's the if he's that spirit, that means his spirit is in the earth right now. Okay, and he he's bringing the spirit of uh, of tribulation and turmoil to all those that oppose him. He said, if you're not with me, you're against me. OK, so when he brings his, this famine, this war, this evil, the time of Jacob's trouble, the mark of the beast, the, the collapse of the dollar, you know, all of those are prophetic things, man. And so that's what we got to keep focus on, you know, just like this picture here. It has things around it, you know, what I'm saying uh, it says like serious and things like that. You can't really see the things that are uh, around. You just see prophecy. OK. You can't really see all of the other words, man. You know, but uh, I look like Don says on here, time of doing. Okay, and that's what we need to be in, the time of doing, man. Doing the work of the Heavenly Father. Okay, it says for the harvest, uh, uh, the harvest is plenteous, but the laborers are few, man. Okay, so he has a small amount of men going out and telling his word. Okay, and so just like this, you can barely see the other words around it. You should be occupied in prophecy. All right, Yahweh Shah said, occupied till I come. OK, so we're occupying in the things in which he he gave unto us. And, you know, I, I'm, I'm uh, in transit right now, so I don't have my scripts, you know, but uh, this this is the beauty of it. That the Lord said he's going to uh, that the Lord said he was going to seal the words in our inward parts, man. OK, and that, that's a beautiful thing to have, man, because a lot of people are not going to understand that. A lot of people need that book in front of them, you know, but they're going to rent the books of the law. They're going to be taken away and trying to ban the Bible. You know, so with Yahweh shot the spirit of prophesy, prophecy, that's what we got to stay occupied in, man. Best believe, do not forget that 2018 is the year of prophecy. And Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is still is not done his work yet. All right. So with that, I want to give all praise unto Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, Bashim Rakal Kodash, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace, blessing, and mercy to you, brethren, around the four corners of the earth, pushing his word of sincerity and truth. Your call, your call, your call. Endure so we can get the hell up out of here and go home, brothers. All right, Shalom.